Eight sprinters have made it to the Olympic finals in the 100 meter race. And how many different ways can the gold, silver, and bronze medals be awarded? Let's learn about this problem here. We have a total of eight sprinters, okay? And they can either get gold, silver, bronze, first, second, third. And if we know that from the Olympics, only one person can get the gold, only one person can get the silver, and only one person can get the bronze. So there's three different prizes that are out there split between eight people. So let's start with the gold. As you're running the race, right? Running the race, there are eight sprinters. Only one of them can be first. So there's eight options to get first place. Once first place person crosses that finish line, there are seven other runners left who can get second place, the silver. And lastly, for this option here, once first and second place have crossed the finish line, the gold and silver, there are six other runners left who could go for the bronze, get third place. After third place crosses, well, you're not making the podium, so we don't need to add that here. So we have eight, seven, six, multiply that out, and we get a 300 and 36 ways. And so there are 336 ways that the eight sprinters can get gold, silver, and bronze medals. I hope you learned something here about this permutation in mathematics. And as always, thanks for watching.